Welcome back everybody to another video of Beginner's Barbecue Outdoors. So today we're going to be doing some shotgun shells on our Z-Grill. My name is RJ and this is Beginner's Barbecue Outdoors. So this is another video that you guys recommended. Last week you guys also recommended pig shots and that was a big success. And this is the second thing you guys recommend. So let's go ahead and get this going. So before we get into this, let me show you. This are hand-picked rubs that I chose from Lane's. So we got our signature. You guys saw that already that I loved. This is a blackening, which I heard a lot of great things about this one. And this is the bad boy that I've been waiting so I can start on my brisket. And of course the sweet heat, which love it. So these four are the ones that you're mainly going to see on this channel. Now there is a link in the description if you guys want to check them out. And let's not forget our Spellbound too. Alright, so these are the things that you guys are going to need. We got one pound of regular ground sausage. I got it from Jimmy Dean. Half a cup of cheese, shredded cheese. These manicotti, they're damn hard to find, but I found them. Some bacon, and that's pretty much it, and whatever rub you choose to add on them. All right, so we need a mixing bowl. Go ahead and add our pork sausage. Add the whole one pound. Now we're gonna add our cheese. Now the ones that I've seen, they add little dice of fresh jalapenos, which I figured uh, I don't have those for today. I just figured I'd do it like this. Kids are going to want to taste this. I don't want to. Know, I don't want it to be a little spicy for them. So for this, of course, I'm going to go ahead with the spellbound. That's what I had planned already. We're just going to add just a little dab, not much, just a little bit. Now go ahead and mix it. All right, guys. So here you have it, all mixed in there. Now we take these So there's seven, there's 14 total And there are some that are cracked though So we're not going to use those So you really got to be careful with these that you don't crack them Alright, so now let's go ahead and stuff these guys in here So pretty much you're going to do halfway and then turn around and do the rest. And one side looks like that already. And, and you can see where it's at right here. There you have it. So we're going to go ahead and do a couple and we'll be back. Alright, so here we have it. We did nine total with one pound of, ground beef, of pork ground beef. We did nine. So now we go ahead and wrap them in bacon. Just like that, look at that, oh yeah. One strip of bacon does one of these. So we're gonna do the rest and we'll be back. So now that we have these ready, already wrapped in bacon, let's go ahead and add our little bit more rub on the bacon. So how are we gonna cook these bad boys? We're gonna put our Z grill to 300 degrees. It's gonna take us about an hour. I'm gonna check them in the last, 10 minutes before the hour and check to see where our pork sausage is at. It should be at least 160 or higher. That being said, let's go ahead and fire up our Z grill. Also at the 50 minute mark, we're going to add some barbecue sauce uh, so I can cook with barbecue sauce in the last 10 minutes. The Z grill is up to 300 degrees. Let's go ahead and add these bad boys in here. We'll be back in 50 minutes to add our barbecue sauce. All right, it's been 50 minutes. 
and they're looking great. So let's go ahead and add our Kinda Sweet from Lane's. Rub it all around. We'll be back in 10 minutes. All right, it's been one hour. Oh man, look how great they look. All right, let's go taste them. All right guys, so here you have it. And before we get into this, let's have a quick recap of what we did today. So let's go ahead and grab one of these. That. Uh -huh. Let me get a bite size cut. And we have a little bit of our kind of sweet on this. Bam. So I'm gonna go ahead and wait just a little bit because it's a little hot. And that being said, I wanna know, listen, here's a question for you guys. How many of you guys play fantasy football during the NFL season? I love playing fantasy football and maybe I can start a, a subscriber league if we have enough people. So put in the, leave me a, a comment if you are one of those people that like to play. That way I know how many we got. Also, don't forget to check out the link in the descriptions for all the Lane products. This is one of the best ones too. You guys want to check them out. You will not be disappointed with their rubs and their sauces. Also, Sea Grills is it has a sale for Father's Day. And they're giving they gave me a code to give you guys for a 5% off that special price. Remember, links are in the description. All right, let's give it a try. Oh, wow. I never knew these guys either until you guys said something. Holy moly. Wow, this is good. Man, the sausage in there, it's, and you, you figure that, is it enough time? Is it, is the Makani gonna cook well? You know, being wrapped in bacon and with the temperature you're going, but no, it, it's, Wow. This is great. Wow. This and the pig shots, wow. I don't know, this, this, this. If I had to pick the pig shots or this. Oh man, I don't know, that's hard. Let me know now in the comments, which one do you guys prefer? The Shotgun shells, pick shots, or both? Because as of now, I, I, I do both. I mean, pick shots are really good. These shotgun shells are really damn good. Make sure to hit that like, hit that boom, hit the subscribe button. Check out these videos, and I will see you guys next time.